How's it going guys? It is Unbox O'Clock and that means it's time for another unboxing. This time we stick into the PC components and we have an ASUS motherboard, more specifically the Z170 Deluxe motherboard. More of a gaming focused piece of tech. Every PC gamer knows that a good PC rig starts with a good foundation in the form of a quality motherboard. And the Z170 is just that. First things first is you're getting two HDMI ports, which is pretty cool, as well as six USB 3.1 ports. The nice thing about the USB ports is that they are 3.1, which supports up to 10 gigabytes a second transfer speeds. That's, that's some freaking speed. Imagine what you can do with 10 gigabytes a second transfer speeds. That's like, I'm trying to even think, well, you, what, what, what you could do, you could do anything. 10 gigabytes a second, ah! You could transfer like your entire game Steam library in like 12 seconds. That's insane. I think they're lying. They have to be lying, but they're not. That's what it says in the box. <laughs> One of the biggest things is that it supports DDR4 RAM. Okay, and as you know, DDR4 RAM is the new hotness. Gotta have it, because DDR3 is old news, and if you have it, you suck. There's also a very handy little catch that can be used to remove the RAM instead of trying to fight with your motherboard to get your RAM out or get it back in. So that's made a lot easier as well as the ability to overclock that DDR4 RAM even further because this motherboard is that badass. Not only that, but they made it really simple to overclock the motherboard. In fact, it's basically one click thanks to the awesome bundle and software that makes it really easy to overclock yourself. One click and you can bump up the performance by almost 700 which is not bad. So it definitely helps to have a one-click easy software process to just pump up that performance. We all know what that means. Smooth graphics for them whores out there. Graphics whores or just whores. I don't know if I should just play the games. I don't think they have time. It also has the fastest onboard Wi-Fi that can reach up to speeds of 1,300 megabytes a second, which is pretty useless in South Africa because our bandwidth is such horse poop. So it's a nice to have. But I, I doubt any South African gamer would ever utilize it. It also has five times protection for things like power surges. And as we know, living in South Africa, load shedding and power surges is something we have to deal with on the rig. So it's good to know that it has special bolts and surge protection and things like that to help your mobile stay intact, mofos, so that your ports don't fry and that happens all the freaking time. But at least you know you got backup. So that's all from me, guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick look at the Z170 Deluxe motherboard. For a more detailed write-up, as usual, check out the SA Techie website. I'm going to leave a link to Goss Review in the description. He puts way more detail into it, so if you want to see specs and all that sort of stuff, and a few benchmarks, you can go check it out, the SA Techie website. I'll leave the link below. I think he enjoyed it. I think he gave a pretty good score, so check it out. Otherwise, guys, join me for another unboxing as I work towards getting you your dream rig, telling you what components to use, what components not to use, how much it's gonna cost, how much it might not cost. Speaking of cost, this motherboard's probably about 2,000 Rand upwards, so it's not cheap, but you pay what you get. Till next time, guys. Take a rest.